Hello, and welcome to another episode of Exact Tax, brought to you by Actionable Insights. My name is Seth Harrison, and today I want to talk about creating a custom line item out of components. Sometimes in a commercial space, it might be warranted to invoice various materials. If you're buying tons of boxes of duct tape, it might be worth it to invoice for it on a job. So, how exactly do I create a line item for duct tape? It's not a line item, but it is a component that exists in many line items in Xactimate. So here I have my X28 screen open, and I'm in the Estimate Items tab up here. And I'm going to come down here to start to create a line item. Now the first thing I have to do is determine what category. And as an example I've given is a mitigation environment where you're using a lot of duct tape in a commercial space that you want to invoice for. So first thing I'm going to do is type in my WTR category code because this is a mitigation job. And then for selector, I'm going to hit this right here, or you can hit space bar, but it's going to open the side menu. And I want to change up here in the top right from PL selectors to PL components. And I'm going to type in here, duct tape. And there it is. And I'm going to hit OK. Now, if you notice, the price on that was 849 San Diego regional price list. But nothing added here, over here. So we'll get to that step next. First, next thing I want to do, just as a reminder, is to type in my custom uh, description. So duct tape uh, one roll. And I'm going to have a calc of one roll this example. Then I'm going to come over here. You can notice that I'm already on unit price and I see this I for information. I'm going to click it. And you'll see that there's nothing in here yet. So while it's given me the option to, as a selector for duct toe component, I've not actually added the duct tape to the line item. So now I'm going to come over here to add, to add a component. And the type here, assembly info, type. And I'm going to make sure that it's material. And then I'm going to come down here to component code. And it's going to open up the side window and I'm going to type in duct tape. Voila, I'm going to hit OK. And then I'm going to just click in this box in supporting events. If I click out, nothing happens. But if I click here, it shows none. And I now have a line item for duct tape. It's a material only line item. It's using the component that already exists within the Xactimate price list. And I'm going to hit OK. Now you'll notice that it hasn't added anything else. But once I hit OK, I now have a line item. In my estimate, WTR DCT, it's using the selector code for the component. It has a description, a customized description, and it has the price for the wherever your regional price list is for the material of duct tape. It's using it uh, already. So this has been another exact tech about how to create a custom uh, line item for a specific material component that's within Xactimate. Hope you've enjoyed. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you next week.